doing bells. Just doing little one. One scratchies. You want scratchies? Ay ay. Don't eat the camera, Bella. Do you need the scratchies? Do you need the scratchies, little messy? Come here. Hello, little one. How are you? You're coming for my shoulder. No, you're coming for the camera. You're so naughty. And there's my closet. Look at that. <laughs> what you doing? Step down, Bells. Good girl. Look how well trained you are. Look. Hey, Jija. You should get your scratchy pot. You should get a scratch pot. Hmm? Yeah, you need a scratch pot. You should get a scratch pot. You need your scratch pot. Hmm? Hello. Can I have a shake? Can I have a shake? 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 Come on. Just because I have the camera, all the training's gone out the window. Hold mommy's hand. Hold mommy's hand. Just one, two. Just one. Just one. Good girl. Good girl. What a good girl. Yes, she is. She's such a good girl. Yes, she is. What's Happy doing? Hey, piggy girl. Are you eating? Are you eating? Are you enjoying your little birdie lamp? Yeah? Niji boogoo. Niji boogoo. Alright, I thought this might be a good opportunity to show you guys what we feed the birds. We're planning to do an official video on this on our parrot channel sometime really soon, but for now, let's just show you guys what we feed them. So we used to feed them exclusively Harrison's. And like every winter, their appetite has basically gone down to near zero and all three of them have suffered a significant loss in weight. So just to boost up their appetite, we have added the Supreme Natural. These are not uh, scented and then they don't have coloring, so considering some other brands that are available, this would be at the healthier end. In fact, before switching to Harrison's, Supreme used to be their main diet. But since then, we've um, our vets told us that Harrison's healthier. So we've switched to that, but I don't think it's very delicious for our birds at least. So whenever their appetite drops, we find that adding Supreme is extremely helpful. So to their main diet, we do half and half Harrison's. And we also add a bit of millet. And some people say millets are terrible. Well, it's only terrible if you're feeding them a lot of millets. But what this one has is it's calcium fortified. Who was that? That was very loud. Calcium fortified. So I'm touching the food, so I think Lemon thinks that he's getting new food, which he shouldn't because he's been eating like a piggy. Yes, right, Bella? Look at her. This is mommy's little helper. Well, anyway, so it's calcium fortified, so we feed them that. And this is strawberry flavor, so the birds are more inclined to eat it. We also give them some Nutri Berries, and our bird's favorite is the Senior Bird Formula, which has omega 3 and omega 6. And we found that this is actually very helpful for um, Happy's feathers. It's just gotten a lot glossier. It's really good for everybody's feathers, really. But with Happy, she's an overzealous plucker. So if you haven't already noticed, she has those black markings on her feathers from over, over not plucker, overzealous groomer. So you have, um, if, you, if you haven't already, there's some black marks on her feathers, which means she bites them and she's grooming herself too much. So these help with that. It's also very delicious. At least our birds find it very delicious. And this one's fortified just like other pellets. You can see that it says it's made with 61% pellets. Honey, can you play with lemon so he stops screaming? What's he doing? That's I actually don't know why he's screaming. That's not happy, that's lemon. Anyway, so um so apparently he got into Bella's cage and was screaming probably because he got lost there. Or, or he got scared there. Most likely he got scared there. Probably he got scared there. Look at Lemon. Because Every time he goes into Bella's cage, Bella gets really, really mad at him. So probably he got into Bella's cage by mistake and then he got scared because all three cages are connected. Anyway, so the Nutri Berries, like it's made with 61% pellets. So again, it's another way to encourage your birds to eat. Perhaps not, definitely not as healthy as Harrison's, but it's better than them starving. And of course, we have the Reptic Calc has calcium fortification for Bella. She gets about a pinch and all the other birds get Clay Cal which is also another calcium supplement. Yeah, our birds need a lot of calcium. I know, especially in Canada, because we get so little sun, so lack of vitamin D, so calcium supplementation becomes kind of key. For the snacks that we feed our birds, we do, okay, don't yell at us, but we do give them some sunflower seeds just as a treat. 
and they also get this fruit and nut parrot treats and these kind of things become really handy come autumn and winter when we can't get access to fresh vegetables and fruits for chop a lot of people really take for granted that you can get fresh vegetables and fruits every day but for us that's not a reality yeah, and this one, spicy Santa Fe parrot and macaw treats are especially nice because they're basically dried peppers and nuts. So, you know, as far as like the, on the spectrum of healthy snacks, these definitely belong to them. And we feed them some Abbey cakes as well, which has 50% pellets and 50% seeds. So again, while they are snacks, they still have healthy nutrients going into them and they're not just eating crap. <laughs> So yeah, so this is kind of what we feed our birds and almost every evening we usually just stay with them because the bird room is also our office and then we do our things while the birds come out of cages and play in their playstations. Hey boo! Hello little bubba. Where'd you go on? Are you scared of the camera? Are you scared of the camera? Come here. No, yeah, that's better. You're just a little scared of the camera. I know. I know, I know. You too, baby living. Ah, Bella, you're so jelly. You're so jelly. Give Lemon a chance. And you yappy. Who's your boo boo? Oh, look at her. She's so cuddly. Oh my goodness. Happy's the best. She's not camera shy, is she? No, she's in fact a superstar. And as I say that, she just flies away because Bella came <laughs> with scary force. Why are you being so jelly today? Why are you being a jelly bean, huh? Why are you being a jelly bean? You're such a jelly bean, yes! Happy! Where did happy go? <laughs> Here you are, you little jelly bean. What am I gonna do with you? The birds are out with their mommy. Hello, baby! Who's your boo boo? Who's your little baby? Hi! Hi! You're too funny. You think you're so funny. You think you're so funny. Yeah. Hi! <laughs> Hello, little bells. How are you? They're having some yummy snacks. Nicer than the ones that they usually get. They're having some nutri carries, nutri carries, <laughs> nutri berries and abbey cakes. So it's slightly yummier variety of their usual food, of course. And Lemon's enjoying his food. And then there's some dried peppers and calcium forwarded by millet in there as well, as well as some almonds. Yeah, you guys are very happy birds. And Happy's enjoying her little meal as well. Yes, you are. Look at you. Look how beautiful you are. She's taking an almond. Oh, poor little baby. For her to actually dig into an almond, she has to grab it with her little foot and really work at it. So it's good foraging for them too. Yeah, yeah it is. Look at you. Yeah. And we break apart the apple cakes and the nutri berries for them and then mix it in with the rest of their food so that they get a good variety and they're not dropping large chunks of nutri berries while they eat. And Abby cakes, we break break it apart for them as well. Not into like fine pieces, but into smaller pieces for sure. Right, little man? Right, little one. Hey, lemon. It was pretty. Were you working on your pasta? Were you working on your pasta, yeah. little one? Were you working on your pasta? Yeah. Who's a pasta boy, huh? Who's a pasta boy? Who's a pasta boy? Yeah. Who's a pasta boy? Are you a pasta boy? Are you a pasta boy? Who's a pasta boy? Oh, there's a little baby. Hi, hey, little one. Oh, hey, little one. Hi. Oh, I love you, little lemon. You're so sweet. Okay. What a little sweetie poo poo for mama. Oh, yes, you are. You already put right under your food bowl. I just saw that. And now I'm gonna have to check your food bowl if you pooed in it. Hmm. Don't pull on your food, lemon. Mm -hmm. Don't pull on your food. Oh, my handsome boy. I love you so much. I love you so much. Yes, you're so handsome. You're so handsome. <laughs> He's like, Mommy, I'm gonna go back into eating. Okay, it doesn't look like he put on his food. Thank goodness. <laughs> yes, thank goodness. Right, Bells? Yes. So, as you guys know, we feed um, Happy and all the birds actually the fauna flora from Harrison's, which is a probiotic. And this is gonna be for all three birds, so don't worry, this is not just gonna be for Happy, but look how Happy likes to take it. Look at this. Happy, 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 are you ready to take your probiotic? <laughs> you know, like on the instructions, it says to sprinkle the fauna flora to the food to trick them into eating it because they're not supposed to like this, but Happy loves this stuff. Look at this. 
So she just takes it from the spoon like a little baby. It's amazing. Good for her because of the three birds, I know that she's probably the most vulnerable against intestinal infections. So yeah. this is amazing. I'm so happy we found out about this. Mm -hmm.